my friends and welcome to the Walters Art Museum online. My name is Kelsey and I'm an education coordinator at the museum. I want to thank you all so much for joining us today wherever you are to look at art and to make art. Today we'll be taking a close look at the painting The Church at Aragni by Camille Pissarro and then we'll create our own bubble paintings. Let's get started with some close looking. Do you like to paint? How do you make a painting? What do your brush strokes or the marks made by a brush look like? Pretend your finger is a paintbrush. Make a few brush strokes in the air. During the 19th century, painters experimented with new ways to paint. French painters like Claude Monet, Alfred Sisley, and Camille Pissarro were part of the Impressionist movement. These painters use thin, noticeable brush strokes. They like to paint outdoors and often painted landscapes. Pointillism grew from Impressionism. What do you think pointillism is? Pointillism is a technique of painting with tiny dots of pure color that would blend in the viewer's eye. Let's zoom in on this painting. What do you notice about Mr. Pissarro's brushstrokes? Now let's zoom out. How is the painting different when we see it from far away? Let's continue to think about dots and colors as we create our own bubble paintings. For this project, you will need paper, water, dish soap, a shallow dish, a fork, a straw, food coloring, or liquid watercolors. Start by filling a shallow dish with soap and water. Whisk it together with a fork. Then add a few drops of food coloring or liquid watercolors. I'm using food coloring here. Use a straw to blow bubbles in your dish of soapy water. Keep going until you have colorful bubbles spilling over your dish. It's okay if this gets messy. Place your paper on top of the soapy foam pushing down gently. Hold it down for a moment. Lift the paper and set it flat on the table. The print will be foamy and wet. You may choose to blow more bubbles and add more color and repeat these steps on the same piece of paper to layer your colors. That's all for now, my friends. For more resources, be sure to visit our website, thewalters.org, and follow us on social media. I hope to see you next time at the museum. Bye.